So Dave's out here waxing the RV. This side has not been done yet. It's a cloudy day. And I'm hoping, because it's cloudy, be able to see where it's shiny. A lot of shadow from the tree there. Makes yeah. Blotchy. Well, I'm just going to kind of walk around and get what I can. Yeah. The, the black area and the dark goldish tan area. Desert beige. Desert beige, okay. Is shiny. You can see reflection from the tree in it. But when you look up at the tan area, it's very dull. I guess the sun is just faded it out over time yeah. and it actually it looks dirty even though you just washed it but you can see where the shiny stuff is because you can see reflections and stuff in it but when it comes to the tan part uh-uh we're Dave and Karen from Wax on Wheels and we sold our sticks and bricks to RV full-time now that we are retired we travel with our heavy-duty truck Leroy our two k motorcycles our DRV Dixie and our smart car Zippy don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell to be notified when we post a new video. This down here you washed and it still looks dirty and there's no shine at all to it. But again, the dark area and the, would you call it desert sand? Yeah. You can see that there is some shine to that. Desert beige. Desert beige. So Dave's got some work ahead of him on this side. He already finished the other side. We'll go take a look. Okay, this is the other side, which Dave has put how many coats? Three. You've got three coats on here, and you're using Poly Glow. There you go. It says it's for the wet look. So it's good for marine as well. You've used this on a boat, and it worked out yeah. good on a boat. Yeah, I figured it was good for boats. Now, yeah, let's see. And what does it say as far as what you need to do with it? Is, you know, do you, does it's it say far, how many coats or how, in be, how far in between each one? Or? It said two to three coats. Uh, let me see. Blah, 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 blah. Does not contain wax and keep your boat or RV shiny. There's no wax Clean. in it, huh? Nope, no wax in it. Reapply it two to three coats of poly coat every six to 12 months. Maintenance is easier and dirt and grime and grease and all that washes off a lot better. So, how much time between each coat? Because you probably have to kind of let it cure. It's a, it's a polyurethane, right? Yeah, well, you just put it on. It's a polymer. Polymer. It's a, you put it on, you just let it dry for about 20 minutes, if that. And do it again? And then do it again. And you use a mitt. Comes with a mitt. Terry cloth mitt. You just put some on there and you go nice and slow with it. If you go fast, you start to make streaks and bubbles. And you don't want that. So you don't need a lot on here, it goes a long way. So I noticed you changed your method as you've been doing this, and now you got just light touch to it, and you don't do any buffing or anything nope, afterwards. No buffing. It's on there, it's on there. It's on there. Because you on had there. a little, it was a little streaky the first go around. Yeah. And then you kind of figured out it needed to be slower, thinner. Slower and thinner. Yeah, I was yeah. putting, you know, good old American. <laughs> if some is good, well, more's got to be better. <laughs> yeah, not in this case. Not in this case. So looking at this, I don't know how well the, pick, the camera's going to pick it up, but on the side you've completed here, I can see reflections of the trees in that tan color, which you couldn't see at all before. So that looks... That just looks good, Dave. <laughs> yeah, looks like new. That looks really good. This is three coats on here so far? Yep. And it even, uh, these things, like the plastic vents and things. Uh-huh. Oh, that, yeah. That's, it, uh, that's shiny They now. dull out over time, and that brings it back to life, too. Yeah, that one up there. Yeah. That's all shiny now. I can see the reflection yeah, of the tree in it. the floor like crazy. Right down to the handles on the doors. So, how long did it take you to do this one side? Uh, probably all together about maybe four or five hours. Taking my time. Be interesting to see what other people think is a good product. Because yeah. this is really all you've tried so uh, far. Oh, I've tried. I've tried Mother's Polish. Uh, what's the other stuff? Uh, there's, you know, spray waxes, wipe and dry, and that. 
dry wash stuff. Reflections? Yeah, reflections. So now the reflections, I think, works nicely if you've kept up with it and you just want to kind of keep yeah. keep it up and not have to spend a whole lot of time. And I, I like that product but myself. It, it didn't do this. But anyway. no, it doesn't bring the whole shine back to it. This no. is like it gave it a whole new coat yeah. of uh, clear coat on it almost. Right. Yeah, so. It's a... Uh, so far, this is the best stuff I've found. If you guys have any suggestions for other products, please put them in the comments below. And our front cap, bottom right hand corner, is quite dull. I don't know if you can tell or not. It really has hardly any shine at all to it. So we'll see how that looks after the fact. Dave actually already has one coat of new finish. Just, that, a, just this, on this area. Is that spray right bottle? Here. No, it's not a spray bottle, it's a paste. Oh, a paste? Yeah. And you're not happy with the results, are you? No. Ugh, I mean, AC's peeing on me. Oh, yeah. That's not good. I can't do this with the AC peeing. Oh, shut it down. Yeah, that just uh, has no shine to it there. None. You know, you kind of get used to what your rig looks like over time, and when the sun fades it and such, you don't really notice it so much. But now that you're actually looking at it and it says it's been driving you crazy, yeah. it just like has no shine to it. Not on that cream color. No, you're driving me over the edge. This is how you do it. Gotta shake it up a little bit. A little bit. Just a couple little drops. Give it a little. Squish around. Hike up the lat. Yeah, there's a tip for you. If you have one of these retractable ladders, put a noodle around the top of it. You gonna make it shiny like your head? Shine on it like my noggin. That's it. You just slowly wipe it across there and and you can kind of tell where you've been and where you haven't. Is this your first coat on the cap? Yeah. Do you need to go in both directions or just one? What do you mean? Up and down, side to side? No, just one, side to side. Well, aren't you the unsafe person doing that with your ladder? <laughs> Fairly unsafe. So that takes about 20, mi hey, 20 minutes. Safety third. Yeah, I, I know. So it takes about 20 minutes to dry, and then you do another coat, another 20 minutes, do another coat. Yeah. Or one today, one tomorrow, depending on weather and such. Yeah. Now it's supposed to rain tonight. Yeah, we'll come back and see how it looks. One of the places that I noticed that was the dullest was underneath the window. On that angled piece and he's put several coats on this and it has a shine to it now and I can see reflection in it which I couldn't before how far can you go with one mitt full of that stuff uh, you probably get like a quarter of this cap oh that's pretty good So you got to be careful that when it's wet that you don't go back over it again. It's like you wipe it on once and then leave it alone. Yeah, don't try to go back and touch up something you missed. Good to know. Good to know. You got to do the whole area. Here, let me get that camera on. Mm-hmm. How many coats you got on the front? I got two on the front. <gasps> oh! You got some shine on there now, boyfriend. There's some shine on that. That was really dull before. I can see reflection in it. Wow. That was probably one of the worst spots. Now, well, let's see. Oh, my. Yes, I can see reflection and shine on that tannish, yellowish color.
it all looks shiny now instead of just where the stripes are. Wow. I don't know if the camera can pick up the difference, but it's a big difference. Looky here. Huh. It's hard to tell. Don't have any trees for a reflection back here. Well, I can I can actually see me in there. Yeah. Oh, a little bit more from here. Boy, does that look a lot better. 100%. Uh, it did the job. Oh, you can get some good reflection up there. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, I could especially see the reflection here. I couldn't see any of that reflection before. I know. That stuff does the job. Well, actually, I did the job, but that stuff does the job. Uh, how many beers, Dave? Oh, oh this is a 12-packer. Over a couple days. Over a couple days, <laughs> yeah. That and a dinner out. That and a, yeah, that and a dinner out. <laughs> Maybe a foot massage. Would you use the same stuff again? Or oh, you... oh yeah, I'm gonna use it on a on Leroy on a truck. Oh yeah, and hopefully the bugs will fly right off then. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice? You think you'll get better gas mileage oh, now? Oh, absolutely. Probably another four or five uh, miles a gallon. <laughs> absolutely. Watts on wheels. Out. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. We'd love to hear from you in the comments below, even if it's just to say hi. Don't forget to subscribe.